Hello guys, and welcome to a video where I just show you what I've been doing today, and a bit of yesterday. So, um, yesterday I built this nice house, let me give you a 360 view of it. Whoop. And I'm gonna go inside. And I've just been playing around with some redstone. So, um... As you can see, I got a little lever here, which will open up a little staircase going down. And then over here you have a room with nothing in it, which I should decorate. And then you have this thing with pressure plates. And it turns out to be a 3x3 three three piston door. And then we come down here, and we have a little redstone room, which is quite nice. I like it, and, um, might want to turn off that. <laughs> so, it's just a room that looks nice with pressure plates. Um, haven't hooked up this one, which is meant to do everything. I'll do that soon. So first, uh, I'll show you the easiest one thing that I've made here. You've got brewing stands furnaces, and bits of water there. Uh, so that's your brewing stand area. And then you've got some crafting tables. Just close that again. And then you have the most complicated part of the build sort of thing. Which is actually a flush three by three door flat secret thing. Uh, those two three by three piston doors I did not design. Everything else here I designed myself. Uh, so you have your chest room, this chest, and stuff. And you've got everything you could want, all the storage you could need. And that's sort of what I've been doing today. Let me just turn it off. I'm going to show you some of the redstone. I'm going to show you some of the redstone behind this. Let's go back to the top. So the staircase here, the automatically opening and closing one. That was done yesterday, as well as this house here. Um, I had to put this there to hide some of those pistons. It's just like a little countertop. That is just in case I accidentally broke some stuff. But I can get rid of that now. Oh, so redstone behind this. Uh, where is it? Here it is. It's quite simple. All you have is... Um, just got a lever coming from there, going into here, which will activate those in a nice, nice little, you know, sequence. And then we have this, which is the step below. Um, what happens here is the step will open needs to. Uh, not, let's say when you open the automatic, uh, not automatic, the staircase, that one stair needs to open after the rest of the staircase is opened. So I've got this, so redstone will go straight through here, but it won't pass through until this has been turned on, which is a bit of a delay, and then turning off, you should instantly turn off, so... We instantly turn off the redstone. I don't know if I need to make it that complicated, but I did it that way. So that's the simple redstone behind that. And then, if you want to check out the redstone in the... Like, build one of those 3x3 three three piston doors, you can... Uh, find it on YouTube somewhere. Um, so this one was designed by... What is YouTube name? <laughs> Let me look at quickly. Oh, uh, wait, no. Ah, oh, 
Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, no, I'll put it in the description. I'll put it in the description. Oh, it's Mumbo Jumbo. That's it. Mumbo Jumbo. Pretty sure that's it. Look, he made this. If you want to check out his video on it, I might send a link into the 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 the, the description for it. So we got less redstone. Actually, like a two by seven by nine, I think this one. And I have a T flip flop gate there to turn it off and on by a pressure plate. How am I getting up here? How am I how do I get back up? Here we are. Uh so that's that redstone. As I said, if you wanna build it, check out Mumbo Jumbo's video. And then redstone behind this. I'm gonna just uh, whoops. Wondering my why my skin is weird is just because I was doing stuff and fiddling around. So I got the redstone down here. Like this is for the that goes down into a T flip flop gate, which goes to there, and then that ends up into the complicated uh, other piston door, which is I don't think I can actually get you to see some of that redstone. That's my giving me a notification there. Have you heard that? Um, yeah, I can show you some of it. Yeah, it's got redstone. Check out the dude's video if you want to, and that it'll be in the description. This is a key. So there we go. Uh, we have another pressure plate there, which will send a pulse uh, redstone along here into a D flop flip flop gate, which will send a pulse to those pistons there. Around the back, there's repeaters. Those will go up and and down, and then it'll open up the brewing stand. Uh, and stuff. Did I mention? Got little deposit bits of water there. For if you need it for the brewing stands. Then the chest thing. My design is so simple. I had a more complicated version, but then I discovered I didn't need it with this design of building. So, we've got input there, the T flip flop gate. That will send a pulse to these, which will get them to push, but then this also needs an, to um, say when it opens. These need to open first, but they don't need to close first, you want them to close last. So, I've got another one of these weird thingies. Yeah. So that's all the redstone behind uh, here, behind this. Uh, let me just go back. That was me little. F this is me little fiddle around day where I play with redstone, do some playing, and I guess I will see you guys later. Remember to check out. Uh, go and look into the description if you want to see. Redstone tutorials on those two dots there. Goodbye!